Okay, 21. They want the five number summary. Uh, again, I've shown some of you on the TI-84 and 83, either version, um, even the 82 if you still have that around. You can enter these in under the stat function. Uh, go to one variable statistics and the last five numbers will be your five number summary. Um, then we can get the interquartile range by taking the upper quartile minus the lower quartile and that's the one calculation you'd have to do. But I will also show everyone um, because you might not have it and notice there's no calculator here. What we're doing is we're not calculating. That's why we don't need a calculator. We're locating the numbers. So the two easiest ones I always find that once you have it in order is to get the minimum, which is going to be 58, and the maximum, which is going to be 90. Now, I like it when they give it to me when there's an odd number because the number in the middle will be the median. However, we have an even number. This is a little bit more challenging. So the median is going to be halfway through. So if there's 12 scores, there'll be 6 below, 6 above. So I count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. The median's going to be right here between these and the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. The median's going to be halfway between 74 and 78. I figure that out by taking 74 plus 78 divided by 2. Or you could say, well, that's 4, so it's going to be 76. 76 is halfway between there. If you do the calculation, you'll see you will get 76. So that's the median. Now, on this case, since the 76 is not part of the data itself, when we go to find the lower quartile, we're finding halfway between the bottom sets of numbers. So all six of these include 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. It's even. So to get the first quartile, what we're going to do is we're going to find halfway between here. Halfway between 63 and 63. Well, you could take 63 plus 63 divided by 2, but you'll find out that that is definitely 63. You can't get anywhere halfway between 63. On the top half, again, we've got six up here, six pieces of data, so it's halfway. So there's three here, three there. It's going to be halfway between 84 and 88. Um, and again, you can calculate that by doing 84 plus 88 divided by 2. What you'll find is halfway between 84 and 88 is 86. Okay, so that's going to be the upper quartile. There's our five number summary. Our interquartile range is going to be the upper quartile, 86, minus the lower quartile, 63. Um, maybe we'll do it this way. It's a little bit easier. 6 minus 3 is 3. It's 23. So all that's left is to enter those numbers into each here. And that'll get us set to give the check at the end and see how we did. There we go. Um, that's 21. Thanks.